Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to some more Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. So, in the last video, we got the Great Plateau um, Tower activated. And now, we are going to go into our first shrine. I know I'm skipping the uh, cutscene. I apologize. I do that. And I do have two amiibo right now that I can use. I don't know where my booklet is, but I'm going to use those after we complete this one. We'll get some extra items. The Magnesis Trial. Oh, speaking of which, we need to eat in some food. There we go. Got our first rune, or, yeah, our, our first uh, rune. Alright, Magnesis. Manipulate metallic objects. Alright. Get that out the way. Alright. So now we can go up here. Oh wait, no, I need to clear that out. I'm an idiot. Push those out the way. Get out the way. Out the way, ow. That was kind of idiotic, but... And then we come across our first, um... Oh man, what do you, what do you call these things? Uh... I don't know what it's called, I forgot. Um, Sheikah Technology. It's a um, Guardian. Yeah, I couldn't think of the name. <laughs> couldn't think of the name for the life of me. Alright, let's go ahead and grab this. Oh, I can do that with my uh, controller too, wow. I can use the, the, con the gyroscoping to actually move the item up and down like that. Wow, that's cool. I just use the controls. Oh, we got a traveler's bow. Nice. First spirit orb. I'm sorry if I skipped the cutscenes, guys. It's just something I've done it over as a habit. So that's our first trial completed. It seems you managed to get your hands on a spirit orb. Well done. How did you know? The voice, or perhaps just something similar. As one gets older, it becomes difficult to see what's right before one's own eyes. However, that which was once hidden can, from view can often be crystal clear. Perhaps that is not true for everyone. The appearance of those towers and the awakening of the shrine. It's all connected to that sheikah slate you carry on your hip there. What do you mean? It's been quite some time since I've seen that sheikah slate. Long ago, a highly advanced tribe known as the Sheikah inhabited these lands. Great power of their wisdom saved this kingdom time and time again. But their ancient technology disappeared long ago, or so it is said. It is interesting, however, to think that somehow something like that survived all this time hidden away in a shrine. These shrines are tucked away in numerous places all across this land. 
On this plateau, the Lord, I still believe there's still three more. Bring me the treasure from each of those shrines, and I will give you my paraglider. So I need more now. I said treasure, but I never said there would only be one treasure. Whether it's a treasure or four, what's the difference for a young go-getter like yourself? Since I'm feeling generous, I will teach you a trick for finding shrines. It's best to survey the area by looking around from a high point. Let's see here. How about you make your way atop that tower again? I admire your eagerness, but now let me teach you something else before you go. Take a look at the map on the Sheikah Slate. See those blue icons? You should recognize the cave where you woke, the shrine you came from, and the tower. You can travel instantly to any of those places with the Sheikah Slate. Or so I heard quite some time ago. I did not know if it actually works as such. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and break this. Get some items out of here. And we're going to collect uh, some extra Korok seeds in this video. Got an amber. Nice. We have another one. I think this actually has an opal. I'm remembering it correctly. Up, oh, opal. And then we need to grab this. We can get a set of fire and ice arrows over here, which is going to be useful. King. All right, let's make our way over here very slowly. That's what we have to do, you know. Climb up here. <gasps> oh crap! I fell in the mud or the the bog. What do you want to call it? Oh Jesus! Just doing it very carefully so I don't fall in again. We got fire arrows right here. Got an ice arrow right there. And we're going to get up some more Korok seeds in this area. So, first one that we can get is over here. I mean, there's a couple that I missed, but I'll get them later. Let's grab this metal ball, put it in the hole. There we go. Yeah, huh, you found me. Alright, so that's our second one. The next one is right over here. Um, in between these two rocks. Alright, so we got that one. And then we'll go into the forest. I believe there's a couple in here. I'm going to need to look them up. Uh, later, but I, like I said, I'll probably get some of these off camera. But we'll just do some exploring because why not? Just for fun. If I see an acorn in a tree, I know to shoot it. Oh, hunting. We can do hunting too. Oh, damn it. I thought you would die with one hit. Where are you at? Where are you going? Come back here. I'm not done with you yet. Uh oh. We got little goblins. I'm not ready to fight them yet. Uh, I have to hit them directly in the head. Oh, well, they ran off, whatever. Oh, there's the old man. We can go talk to him. Oh, he was hunting. That's right. That's where you can learn about actually how to hunt animals and stuff. Can't carry any more items. Okay. You can actually set a fire under the cooking pot here. Um, see so yeah. You can kill this bird. Yeah, prey down. Raw bird drumstick. I got two raw bird drumsticks, nice. We can cook up a meal. Let's do that. 
pick that up real quick. Meat and mushroom skewer, nice. I don't like getting ones that are like really good because um, then a lot of the hearts get wasted if I don't have that amount of health. Well, there was. Oh, Chicolo tree nut. I know I need to get a Korok leaf, but I don't know where the one is around here. There's one around here somewhere. I just don't remember where. I just gotta do a lot of exploring and stuff. Well, I don't know. Alrighty, guys. Well, I think that's a good point to end off at. We're gonna just head back to the to this little area here. And we'll do some gathering of extra stuff, probably off camera as well. So yeah, so anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.